626 horsepower, 332 kilometers per hour top speed, 0 to 103.8 seconds. The Mercedes-Benz SLR McLaren Roadster redefines the term convertible. More powerful, faster and even more exclusive than ever before. July 2007, Königstein in Taunus. The first SLR convertibles in the world are ready for a test drive in front of the historical Villa Rothschild. When a super sports car like the SLR Roadster sees the light of day, it attracts a vast amount of attention from the journalists and the expectations are exceptionally high. Unique combination of the raciness the, the, the power and comfort. Naturally, I hope that everywhere we stop, crowds of people will gather and look at the car. A highly exclusive car also in terms of the workmanship. The appearance is something truly special and we'll see if it holds what it promises. After the coupe introduced in 2003, the convertible should write a new chapter in the SLR success story. A long nose in the style of the current Formula One racing cars, the side pipes borrowed from the design icon the 300 SL, gills and gullwing doors, an exciting combinatino of past and future. A carbon monaco construction taken from Formula One makes the Roadster as torsion resistant as its coupe brother. This here is the carbon monocoque shell of the SLR one of the most rigid, the most rigid material used in vehicle construction. One-to-one -one Formula One technology. Thanks to the carbon fiber, the Roadster is only marginally heavier than the Coupe, despite the heavy roof construction. The high-tech material also plays a decisive role in accident safety. Carbon does not absorb any energy by deforming, but rather it absorbs energy and then bursts. And the controlled explosion was the key for our researchers for developing this crash cone, which, when the crash cone comes under load, more or less explodes into dust. The energy absorbed by the carbon structure is considerably higher than a traditional sheet metal structure. Safety takes priority. Ultimately, a supercharged 5.5-liter high-performance motor accelerates the SLR from 0 to 300 in around 30 seconds. The finely balanced con rods and crankshafts and the hand-manufactured engine put racing technology on the road. Thus, the Roadster ties in with an old tradition. Time for a family reunion with its ancestor, the 300 SLR. As with the new SLR Roadster, the racing car from the 1950s combines contemporary Formula One technology with the formal elegance of a convertible. In those days, this unconventional combination promised everything except suitability for daily use. Gatstaub supervises the historical racing vehicle collection for Mercedes-Benz. He knows the 300 SLR inside and out. Now, he takes the new SLR Roadster for a test drive. It's absolutely amazing what happens when you step on the gas. This is phenomenal, even in comparison to the old SLR. A foot on the throttle immediately sends 780 newton meters of torque roaring through the axles. The reincarnation of the open SLR legend? Well, I think that the legend was transferred one to one and the vehicle simply offers an amazing driving experience. I think I could drive this vehicle to work every day. The SLR Roadster achieve something which almost no other sports car in the past and present has managed. Bridging the gap between high performance, luxury, and the suitability for everyday use. And that is exactly what makes it unique.